Hello everyone, it is me again. It is uh, Wednesday night. Uh, tomorrow kicks off uh, the weekend of Spigma. And we're gonna be there. The farmhands are up for eight awards. Uh, we're up for our uh, vocal group. We're up for album of the year. 4.0 is up for album of the year. Uh, the song that Mike Waddell wrote for us is up for song of the year, Circle of Wood. We're up for instrumental group. We're up for gospel group. We're up for entertainers. We got a lot of awards, uh, nominations, and we're so honored and we're so thankful that uh, everybody remembered us when it come time for the awards, nominations. We will be there. Let's see what happens. I um, hope it's going to be a good weekend. We have a request from a guy in uh, Japan. I think it's Japan. That wants to hear uh, a song called uh, Home Sweet Home on the Dobro. This is his name. I don't know if you can see that. I'm going to put it right like that right there because I sure don't know how to pronounce it. It's spelled O-N-D-R-E-J. Last name is P-O-S-P-I-S-I-L. Pospisil? Andre, I guess. So, anyway, he wanted to hear Home Sweet Home and he wanted me to play it slow. So I'm gonna slow it down and at the end of it, I'll speed it up just a little bit, but this will be for, for him. This will be playing on my beard. And I hope y'all enjoy this. Let me scoot back just a little bit and let's see what we got here. <laughs> But the tempo would be like a... That, that was uh, for our friend over in Japan. I hope he enjoys that. Um, first one was a little slower just to give him a little example of how he can play a, a different break he wanted to learn. So anyway, come to Spigma. Oh yeah, before we get off here, I want to tell you, Ernie Evans is up for Promoter of the Year. If you go to Spigma, please vote for Ernie because I'll tell you why. He, uh, he took over all of Norman Adams' festivals. And he's got about seven or eight festivals that he's doing and uh, he works hard. He's doing, he's doing more festivals than any promoter I know. And, uh, uh, you know, uh, I think the awards should go to the people that are doing the work. Uh, that's just the way I've always thought. If you're out here on the road all the time, you ought to be rewarded. If you're out here uh, busting your back and, and trying to put on a festival for, for all of us to enjoy, uh, then, then he should be rewarded. That's just the way I think about it. So I'm gonna be ca campaigning for Ernie uh, because I think it that uh, that he deserves the, the reward. Uh, the award for, for uh, promoter of the year. That's just my thoughts. You can you can do what you want to, but uh, but I, I hope that you will take Ernie Evans into consideration and, and vote for him as promoter of the year because you know he he bought he got over the he took over the festivals. COVID come along and, and uh, I felt so sorry for him because uh, it took us all out. Uh, but he kept on and he's kept on and, and we was at his festival uh, last weekend down in Okeechobee, a wonderful festival. Uh, he's got Cherokee coming up. He's got some over in North Carolina coming up. The man works hard, uh, and if you would, uh, when you go to Spigman, if you go to Spigman, vote for Ernie Evans for Promoter of the Year. We'll see you all there. May God bless you as he has blessed us, and we will see you down the road. Thank you all.